Hey YouTube, what's good? It's Sky. I don't know why this took so long to get to me, but this arrived yesterday. And it is the brand new Passion Palooza tub. And I think that this is available on the website now, but I'm not positive. But I was just, I hate TikTok. <laughs> But uh, I hate that they're starting to have early access stuff on TikTok and some stuff that they don't even post about, I guess. So, geez. I miss the days when it was simple and easy and before they were popular. And it just went on the website at the, at the correct time. And I didn't have to watch a live stream. I didn't have to go on TikTok. I didn't have to go on Amazon. I just, I miss the simple times. But I don't know if anybody is has been waiting for this video because if you've been around my channel for a while, you probably know that Tropical Rain used to be my favorite flavor. It's it's up there. Eyeshadow is still number one for me right now. But so many people, including Shock and I guess Ehoff, have said that Shock just thinks it's a complete reskin. But I'm gonna see what I think about that in this video. Um, and I think Eoff just just said he's pretty similar, but this has passion fruit, and Tropical Rain does not have passion fruit. So, I don't know. I'm not going to badmouth anybody. I'm just letting you know the only things that I've heard about this flavor. So, I got this yesterday. I immediately opened it, and I looked at the tub art, and I gotta say, I love this tub art. It is so fun, and I love the colors. The colors are sick. This is kind of... It, it reminds me of the Hornets colorway. Yeah, the Hornet Hornets, the Charlotte Hornets, but also the G Fuel Hornet colorway. So, and then I grabbed an old tub of OG Formula Tropical Rain. So you could just see what the tub looks like. But there's no passion fruit on there. You see that? No passion fruit. Look how gross this is. <laughs> so that is there just in case I need to make a serving of it. But, let's just open this tub. Maybe. <laughs> so I can uh, see what we're working with here. I slightly messed it up. Perforation's a little high on the front, so let me take my knife. Okay, first thing. Let me get this seal off. Here's the thing. This has a blue powder. It's kind of hard to even tell that it's blue, but it's it's blue. But also, Tropical Rain has pretty much the same tint of blue, so that's interesting. Well, this doesn't smell good at all because it's so old. <laughs> but this doesn't... It's kind of got a hint of B.O. Keep it real. <laughs> but that doesn't smell like Tropical Rain to me. I'm not saying that I don't think this won't remotely taste like Tropical Rain because they both literally have, I mean Passion Palooza, it doesn't have Tropical in the name, but it says it's Tropical Passion Fruit. So I'm not saying that there's no chance that it's not going to taste the same for me, but I just, I, I mean, I honestly, if it does taste the same, I mean, I guess it'd be okay with it. I'm assuming it's going to be similar because... I don't know. It's just, it's just that if people are, I cannot get this powder out of the scoop. People that are saying that it's exactly similar are the, are the, my, the reasons for my pain because it's, this tropical rain doesn't have passion fruit. That's my only gripe. <laughs> Assuming it's going to be the regular blue that I'm expecting. Pretty much. All right, guys. So if you've never had Tropical Rain or seen it, this is pretty much the color that you get. And it's one of my favorite G Fuel colors. Keep it real. So let's give this a smell. Okay, so it does smell similar to Tropical Rain. But, it's that passion fruit that is making it different. So. Let's go ahead and see uh, what Passion Palooza tastes like. Let's go. It 
Okay. So, here's the thing. Obviously, it's saying tropical passion fruit. And I am not 100% certain if passion fruits are considered tropical. But if this has anything else in it, I don't know. Because it's only showing the passion fruit on here. So, I don't know what else could be in this flavoring. Because half the time, the antioxidant complex doesn't really help you because it's got all a bunch of things that are in a lot of g-fuels but uh yeah this is as close as you're gonna get to tropical rain since you can't buy tropical rain from g-fuels website anymore but yeah sadly it is pretty much the same. The passion fruit's not even really that strong at all. But, because if you look at a tub of tropical rain, there's no passion fruit. You got pineapple, kiwi, blueberries, and raspberries on there. No passion fruit. <laughs> so, and since G Phil never said that this was a reskin, or a remaster or anything like that that's why I'm to assume that this is not exactly tropical rain because usually even for the the old like phase the other phase flavors that they've remastered um, pretty much it'll tell you if it's a reskin or a remaster you know and they never did that so this can't be exactly the same but this is as close as you're gonna get if you've been missing tropical rain so but this not exactly the same, okay? <laughs> but it's close enough. But I will say on the back end, I can taste the passion fruit because it does give me that passion fruit flavor. Like if you've had type O, it's giving me that passion fruit flavor at the back end. So that's something that I never got from Tropical Rain, so there's that so if you don't like passion fruit i mean ehoff doesn't like passion fruit but i think he was okay with this so i don't know i would just say if you've been missing tropical rain and you're okay with passion fruit you should probably pick this up and it's a really nice tub i like it so i think i would give this an 8 out of 10 nostalgia kind of i guess i don't know i like it I don't, it's not exactly the same, but it's close enough. So, that's going to be it for this review today. Don't forget to check all my links down in the description. Give this video a thumbs up if you enjoy it. And subscribe for more content from me. And I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out.